Hi, welcome back channel, Train Station 2. Alright, finally, uh, Christmas event 2023 is coming and I'm going to share with you, of course, the first video from the Pixel Federation. Alright, hopefully those uh, little jingles uh, warmed you up uh, towards the uh, upcoming uh, event itself. So, uh, of course, this is message from Pixel Federation. Dear station managers with a ho 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 and hey hey hey, it's Christmas time for me. Alright, so as usual, uh, this will be a long event and uh, time to check out will be from the snowman itself. Okay, so very cute icon here. Uh, of course, uh, it's only available for station managers from level 12 onwards. Uh, interesting map, uh, you can see a very beautiful uh, scenery here, very quiet uh, village, uh, all preparing to make those um, event items or you call it Christmas items itself. So really, really beautiful scene here. Uh, you can just imagine the uh, ice cold uh, weather as well as those lights that is like really lights up at night. So very beautiful, very quiet. <laughs> so it's a peaceful village prepares for the greatest holiday celebrations. Can you help them keep up with the Christmas spirit itself? Right. So um, thinking about the raw materials, there are three types of raw materials that comes about uh, in this Christmas event. And uh, what's more important is that uh, all this uh, got to work together to make those uh, manufactured products, which we got to do it in the factory. So um, introducing the raw materials there, the fabric, um, then of course the, the envelopes, as well as the dies. So this tree, you can actually grab it straight uh, directly from the event maps. Hopefully that's what they said and that's what they promised. Um, factory materials, uh, Christmas cards, uh, we're going to make these Christmas cards using decorations. And envelopes. So just wondering what's decoration enveloped. <laughs> so you gotta figure it out yourself. <laughs> so um, and a word here, outsourcing factory info below. I'll come to that later. Um, Christmas present, right? So interestingly, Christmas present uh, in a heart uh, shaped box. Uh, what was it made out of? It's basically decorations and Christmas cards. So you can see it's always a product using other byproducts to be produced. Um, then it comes with a sleigh uh, with letters. So the sleigh letters, you require the raw materials you saw earlier, fabric, uh, and the uh, Christmas card and wood. So these are the few materials that made up for the sleigh with letters. Um, then the handbell, steel decorations, and then it comes with the next items, uh, decorations that came from fabric, and last but not least, I think there's one more item, it's called the Christmas sweater, <laughs> so keep it warm, um, let's see, uh, fabric and decorations, so all this can be produced of course in the event factory itself, that you can find your station, you only have one, um, if you're rich enough, you're going to pay in customer, you have two, alright, so, but that's not for me as a free to play, so hopefully you don't have it as well. So, um, as usual, they mentioned about new feature outsourcing factory is only for the rich. So, um, in the uh, event that you really want to buy it, uh, available for purchase in the event region, and then you can get the uh, material straight out from this outsourcing factory uh, that gives people an edge over those that is free to play. So, for us, we will lose out for those to actually pay to win. So, um, event currency is usual, there will be three types um, Christmas keys. Uh, it's basically the event keys itself that you can exchange for trains, uh, 4,000 for the legendary. Alright, so Christmas coins, uh, these are the ones that events, uh, coins that comes from competition and of course the EPs. So um, you have three people here, Emily, Mayor and Center, they will be your contractors. Alright, so they'll give you jobs to do, so you eventually gain more of the EP and you climb that ranking chart and you get 350 coins. Um, we should call it the Christmas coins and accumulated enough of that you will have 1000 event coins by winning three first competitions uh, using the first place you get 1050 and you can just straight away exchange for the legendary train so uh, this is how the uh, strategy should be working uh, put everything you have in the first three competitions and then uh, you can relax for the rest of it so this is how I've uh, been doing so far um, and uh, it's going to save up millions uh, before you enter into the events you can buy train we'll come to that later on so this is the first common train um, going to share with you uh, all right so i'll say at least uh, there's some team to it right so but i do find some familiar trains that i find quite disappointing um, they're not really 
uh, reinvented designs, um, some duplicate designs that I see. But I think this is still all right. Let's go to the next one, uh, the rare train itself. Let's take a look at the rare train. They uh, call it the North Pole Express. Seems like familiar. <laughs> so I'm not too sure about whether I have this train already or not, but it just seems like very familiar. Um, the next two trains is definitely very, very familiar. Um, gingerbread train, <laughs> right? So um, the Epic Steam, definitely I have this already. And uh, the last, uh, which comes from the legendary, um, the Grass 40, uh, Frosty. So this legendary steam, I believe I have this already. Probably a tweak of a slight design, but it's almost similar. So last but not least, there's a Polar Star uh, 1014. Uh, seems like familiar as well. So I believe it's the duplicate of all the designs of the trains that we have usually from the uh, Christmas events. Um, that then of course there will be trains whereby for people who are able uh, to get um, for gold coins we have talked about spending uh, real gold coins at the start of the event so you can get more of these event trains to start working uh, as the event nowadays you know you really have to get the uh, event trains early so you can grab the requirements items or deliver the require uh, things using these trains and not forgetting um, there's some batch trains let's call it so this batch train is making a lot of headache <laughs> for people um, by now you should be really familiar and uh, basically frustrated <laughs> over this but I think it is something that will stay and uh, not going to be removed anytime soon um, even regardless the number of complaints that you have so all these events trains are the quarter batch trains including those that we purchased just now you can sort it the, the common so I believe the two comments and two rare uh, batch train should be available for purchase using gold and then you can add one more um, after you complete a certain toss and then you have five numbers so two rare and three commons by then and then with that you have five of such batch trains um, then you can work really hard from there on Alright, so of course people who are paid will get even the event pass train, but that's not for me. So as I always urge you to be working really hard for the first three competitions, strike for the 1000 event coin train, and of course to save enough for the 4000 event key trains. With that, then you could complete one of the jobs, um, then eventually they will grant 100 EPs, and you can fly from there onwards. Alright, so that gives you the edge over the rest of people in the fourth competition, and hopefully you meet someone that's kind enough in the fifth and sixth and you can be winning all the way <laughs> right so thank you so much for watching and good luck for a start of the competition goodbye